In Oakland, where two brothers lost their lives in a shooting overnight. Two others were wounded after a house party at a rental property ended in gunfire. The shooting happened on Apgar Street near the Emeryville border. The two homicide victims were students at Berkeley High School, and they were brothers. One was 17, the other 15. KPX 5's Betty Yu has details on the party that led up to the shooting. 17-year-old Jay-Z was a junior at Berkeley High School. A GoFundMe page described him as the quieter of the two brothers. He naturally assumed the role of protector. Angel was 15 years old, a sophomore at Berkeley High School. They were two of six children and leave behind a single mother. Neighbors say about 20 to 40 teens attended what was believed to be a birthday party Saturday night at a vacation rental home on Apgar Street. It just started as a commotion where, you know, young people drinking and um, kind of gathering and started breaking out into bickering and hostility. And before you know it, two guys just walk upstairs and start shooting at each other. Martin Opsall lives across the street. He was smoking in front of his house at the time of the shooting, which he said happened on the second floor of the home. It sounded like two people were exchanging gunfire. It sounded like there was at least two firearms. There was two distinct uh, gunshot sounds, so I don't think they were from the same gun and they were shooting simultaneously, so there's no way that it could have came from the same the same firearm. The Berkeley Unified School District Superintendent said in a statement in part, we are deeply saddened to have learned that two Berkeley High School students and beloved members of the BUSD family lost their lives yesterday in a senseless act of gun violence. The Parent Teacher Student Association added, we are respecting the family's privacy as we stand ready to support them. We will all hold our children close tonight. We will work with the district and the Berkeley High administration to support all of our students through this heartbreaking time. A crime scene cleanup worker said there were still a lot of party decorations inside the two bedroom apartment Sunday. It was mostly just in, around the kitchen area is where we uh, ended up seeing the majority of what was in there. City Council member Dan Kolb said violent crimes in Oakland have gotten out of hand and it will take comprehensive strategy to make progress. It's about uh, intervention, prevention and enforcement and doing what we can at the federal, state, county and city level to get guns off the street. Uh, it's not easy, but we, ha we have to redouble our efforts and invest more dollars to do what we can. And, and I'm absolutely going to be part of that effort. In Oakland, Betty Yu, KPIX 5.